morning, everybody. Father Jim is on another vacation, so we'll start our morning prayer today without him, but let's quiet ourselves anyway. Christ is risen. He is truly risen. This week we, learn, we will learn about one of the earliest Christian leaders to emerge after Jesus' death, St. Paul. He was not always a follower, follower of Jesus. Before he converted or changed his beliefs, he was known as Saul. In the name of the Father, Father and, and the, the Son, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. The stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. The stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. Nice and loud. The stone that the builders rejected. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His steadfast love endures forever. Let Israel say, his steadfast love endures forever. Let those who fear the Lord say, his steadfast love endures forever. The stone that the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. from the Acts of the Apostles. Stephen did great wonders and signs among the people. Then, then some of those who belonged to the synagogue of the freedmen stood up and argued with Stephen, but they could not withstand the wisdom and the spirit with which he spoke. They set up false witness and who said, this man never stopped saying these things against the holy peace and the law. When the council heard these things, they became enraged and ground their teeth at Stephen. Then they dragged him out of the city and began to stone him. And the witnesses laid their coats at the feet of a young man named Saul. While they were stoning Stephen, he prayed, Lord Jesus, receive my spirit. When he said this, he died. And Saul approved of their killing him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. God. Think about this silently in your heart. How might you show how how might you show courage when others make fun of you of your beliefs? Let us pray to God for our needs and the needs of others, our family, neighborhood, and the world. For each need we say, Lord, hear our prayer. That all who are members of the church may hold fast to the wisdom revealed by Christ. We pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For peace throughout the world, that all leaders of prayer may be open to the hungers of their people for justice and reconciliation. We pray. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. prayer. That those who suffer in any way may experience the love and concern of Christ through the generosity of Christ's disciples. We pray. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Loving God, thank you for the example of your beloved disciple in St. Stephen and the other holy men and women who were steadfast in faith despite trials and persecution. Give us the courage and wisdom to do the same. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please join me in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We have some birthdays to celebrate for today. In seventh grade, Adam Schermenauer. Also
also in seventh grade, Cooper Swan. In seventh grade, Madison Swan. And also in seventh grade, Sadie Amos. Happy birthday. What do we say to our birthday people for today? Happy birthday! Please join me in saying the prayer before the cross. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Most high and glorious God, enlighten the darkness of my heart and give me a correct faith, a certain hope, a perfect charity, sense, and knowledge, so that I may carry out your holy and true command. St. Francis of Assisi, pray for us. St. Clair of Assisi, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Have a manic Monday. All right. Thank you for a great Have a great day.